Hey everybody, what is going on? It is Tony from Lomo Paintball and today we're gonna see if buying a barrel kit actually makes a difference. And why? Because who's the best source for paintball? That's us, that is us, it is LomoPaintball.com. So today I am showcasing the Freak XL barrel kit. We're gonna take a stock barrel, board out, we got the Juggernaut, the Mini GS. Stock barrel two piece comes in a 688. So if you have a barrel kit, obviously you have plenty of different inserts to choose from to bore your paint up correctly. So uh, we're gonna shoot the stock barrel first, two pods. I'm gonna throw in a 684, which I'm taking out of this kit with my Freak XL barrel, which that is the proper size. So stock barrel, 688. We bored this paint already, which we're shooting GI, GI Sports paint today. It is 684. So we'll see if buying a barrel kit actually is gonna make a difference. Let's do it. All right, I predict <clears throat> it makes a difference I don't think it'll be like mind-blowingly huge, but I think it'll reduce the amount of strays and, and whatnot, as long as the paint's consistent. For sure, so we've got that GI Sports, the uh, emerald green shell today. I'm not, gonna, I'm not gonna spill out. We got the emerald green in there. So let's, uh, let's do it. All right, Mark, first I'm gonna shoot. Yeah, we're still, we still got a full pot in there pretty much. I'm gonna shoot at the left one with your stock barrel. So, then... so the, it's the middle saw horse. We turned the two sideways guys, so he's got a smaller target, so he's aiming a little more specific. So technically the middle one, right? Technically the middle one, yes. All right. Whoa. More broken paint. All right, hey, you're you're not one. jerking the gun around, right? I'm just not at all. Okay, because that's all. all over the place. Yeah. All right, so I know that the paint usually doesn't shoot that crazy, but should we squeegee the barrel out just so we had a clean starting point? For sure, again? I would. Yeah, that would make the most sense, just so we we know what we're dealing with. Like you said, it's cold outside. This gun has seen some things already, but. Conveniently, I have one in my pocket. As all good paintballers should. Yeah, naturally. You never know if you break a ball. Right, we're gonna take a look. She's nice and clean. So we're gonna start with pod number two then and uh, continue to see like, wow. Yeah, I don't know. It's maybe the cold or whatever it may be, but. Yeah. Might've been a bad batch of paint, but like I said, we're gonna use the same paint throughout. So I don't wanna switch now. True, very true. And I need to make sure I can see your barrel just so people see that you're not, you know, being crazy wiggle wobble guy. Definitely landing a lot more on that center target with the second pod. They're still left, right, up, down, so. I mean, you'd be hitting your target, but you're not gonna win a shooting competition with it. No, no. All right, so that was two pods. Uh, both of these bad boys are empty. <clears throat> Let's um, grab two more and see, see where we're at. All right, guys, now we uh, got a little cleaned up, Grab some fresh paint from the inside. We're gonna take the stock barrel that is bored at 688 off. Uh, yep, 688 there, and we're gonna set that to the side. Now I'm gonna be throwing in a properly bored insert, Freak XL, this is the 684 orange Freak XL insert. We're gonna put this barrel on the gun now and see if buying a barrel kit with the inserts or a barrel kit in general makes a difference in your accuracy. All right, so GI Sports, green emerald paint, obviously that first round paint is a little oily, but you know, it happens, it is what it is, but we've got that green, Emerald again, once again, going into into the gun. All right. All right let's see how much difference it makes. Let's see what we got. It's still cold. Yes, it is still cold. And we're looking, uh, yeah, 684 insert compared to the stock barrel at 688. All right, which one are you shooting at this I'm gonna time? shoot at the one on the far right. So okay. the one on the very end. Test shot and let's go. Oh my gosh, he's hitting it. He's really hitting it, guys. Huge, huge difference. No knock against the stock barrel, um, but it's night and day. I and mean, you really. saw, same paint, we're not... Uh...
I mean, it's spot. So <laughs> for you guys out there that don't believe in boring your paint, once again, this is the Empire Mini GS. This gun is an absolute juggernaut. This thing, stock out of the box, can shoot 12 plus pods. We have an efficiency video on that. A couple efficiency videos, actually. So it's not the gun, I'm gonna tell you right now. And like I said, the stock barrel isn't bad. It, it gets you out there, gets you playing. But if you really wanna dial in your accuracy, get yourself a barrel kit, please. I mean, now it's, you're just it's showing money. off hitting it's, the bowling it's just, pin. It's just money. <laughs> <laughs> ball on ball that's all we need to see it is lomopaintball.com go out there and get yourself a barrel insert kit no matter what it be shop our website see you guys later what it be